hello guys how are you i am heading to st lawrence market i came to drivers and front street and so i'm gonna see what they have over there come along with me okay guys i am about to it's opening hours are tuesday to friday 9 a.m to 5 p.m and saturdays 5 a.m to 4 p.m it's closed on sundays so i'm going to enter Oh, look at the fresh greenery. I've never been here before. Lots of fruits, fresh fruits and veggies. Oh, look at the nice watermelon. All the seeds are out. Peaches. Oh, oranges. Oh, is that grapefruit? <laughs> That's grapefruit. <laughs> and these are oranges lemon oh they have nice stuff here let's go to the meat section <laughs> look at all the meat cut out some nice barbecue and nice meat with seasoning already on it i've never been here before so oh look at the hot dogs Ooh. Look at the hot dogs, nicely rolled up. <laughs> oh, we have seasoned meats already. We have different type of cheeses. Oh, look at the different type of cheeses. Oh, this is brie. I love brie. It tastes very, very good. <laughs> My uncle in France used to buy it for me to eat it. <laughs> so, okay, maybe I'll buy one of this. Le Bon Secret. I believe. This one. I don't know. Is it brie? <clears throat> I'll ask. Oh, this one is the brie. This one is the brie one. Mild and creamy. I'll buy that one. I don't like goat cheese, but and I like com com camembert too. How are you? I am great. Thank you I'm, I'm your trying your camembert and your brie. <laughs> Fantastic. How much are they? $8.99. $8.99. Okay. That's the box and it's $8.99. I hope it's $8.99 for this. Well, it's the same price for them. Okay, came up to eight, almost $18, so I'm paying for it now. I got some brie and camembert. I'll try when I get home and let you guys know how it tastes. Types of olives and tomato and cheese. Oh, this place is huge. I've never been here before. Even if I have been, I've forgotten. <laughs> types of taste look oh look at that that is quite a huge palm hawk look at that huge palm leg my lawyer told me about this cookie that she gave me to taste but I didn't much like the taste maybe they use a sweetener instead of real sugar so i really didn't like that taste that much but it tasted okay but it wasn't for my preference okay we have wines here <laughs> hi how are you good so ontario wine here ontario wine okay let me see i want sir i want something sweet I like something sweet, like a Spumanto Bambino, you know that drink? I don't know that one. I have something like a Moscato. Moscato. It's sweet? It's a sweet white wine, yeah. And how, what is the alcohol percentage? Um, I think it's about average 10, 11 or 12 percent. That's high for me. Oh, <laughs> I need something like 7 percent. Okay. So I do get... Oh, sangria. sangria. It's okay. about 50... No, it's still 11% alcohol, but there's a light one here somewhere. 
and it's for 10 bucks that's a good price See when it says light? Oh, here, light. Yeah. Right in front of my eyes. Light, okay. See, and this is Sauvignon Blanc. It's again very sweet, mm -hmm. but it's only 8% alcohol. That's not bad. I can take that. Let me just double check the sugar. 17 grams. It's not the sweetest in the world, but it's, uh, it's got a little alcohol. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Are you going to go the fridge or are you going to be taking it home? I'll be taking it home. Thank you. <laughs> okay. So you guys come to the Lawrence St. Lawrence Market, right? Yes. Yeah, you'll find a great wine store. <laughs> Look at it. It's a really great wine store. Look at the variety. All Ontario wines, by the way. So support Ontario. Get some money generating for the province. Yeah, come by. Thank you very much, sir. It came up to 11 almost $12. So it's really, really good price. So come and buy. I think that's all I can purchase here. That is all I can purchase here. So, oh, it's a huge market. As you guys can see, a huge market. The one I got, it, it doesn't have, it has 17 grams of sugar and 8% alcohol because I can't take too much alcohol <laughs> okay and there's the fish market oh my god if I had my own place I love tin fish and, oh look at the salmon hi I'm just uh, visiting for the first time and I'm looking at your stuff okay oh my fresh 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 Come and come and buy, please. Come and buy. <laughs> fresh food for you. Healthy, fresh fish. Oh, there's another fish market. Salmon steaks. Oh, shrimps. I love me some shrimps. Look at the tiger shrimps. These are huge. You know, they actually breed tiger shrimps in Ghana. So if anybody wants affordable tiger shrimps, you don't have to go all the way to Asia, just go to Africa and Ghana. Oh, lobster. Oh. oh, look at the snow crabs. Snow crab legs. It's huge. Oh my God. Huge. And look at the lobster. Lobster tails. <laughs> More veg oh, oh vegetables. This year there is pasta, different types of pasta. I thought it was veggies because of the different colors, but it's actually pasta. Oh, it's fun. If I am, I cannot cook. Otherwise, I will buy these kind of stuff and go and cook for myself. I love cooking, by the way. <laughs> I enjoyed it. When I was in Ghana, I was always cooking for my son and my husband. Yeah, this is the food court. People are eating. Can I have lobster roll with fries and green calamari only? Oh, octopus. I've never had octopus before. I don't think I want to try it. It doesn't look like something I want to try. <laughs> okay. Oh, there's more cheeses. There's more cheese things over there. It's a huge market. You can spend about two to three hours here and not see the whole place unless you take your time. So come and enjoy St. Lawrence Market. It's a fun market, hardworking people doing their job, providing you fresh food, fresh meals. I'm sure they even have a place that can teach you how to make a meal with the products that are in here. If they don't, they should do that. Hint, hint. <laughs> 
<laughs> and this is ground beef. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, I am done. I am going to go home. I thank my lawyer for suggesting for me to come here. Oh, I think this must be the place that has the cookies. Yeah, it must be the place that has the cookies. Almond cookies. I'll try. Uh, I'm not much of a sugar fan. Well, for some diabetic one, one thing. And also, I, don't, I just don't like too much sweet, even though I am sweet. <laughs> How much are the almond cookies? Miss, how much are the almond cookies? How much is one? Three pieces for a three. Okay. I can have it with some tea. <laughs> Three pieces for three ninety nine. Yeah, that's good. that's good. May I please have three pieces? I'm going to get the almond cookies. See that they are. They look very delicious. Three pieces for three ninety nine. So yeah, you can't go wrong. <laughs> I have some tea. I love tea and biscuits. I just say, uh, yeah, biscuit is the word that the Ghanaians and English use for cooking. So, yeah, I guess American people use biscuits as the biscuit that they sell at like KFC and, and uh, Popeyes, but the real name for biscuit is cookies in North America. Okay, taste it when I get home and let you know how much, it, how good it tastes. I even feel like tasting the cookies right here, but when I get home, then I'll try it with some tea. I'm trying to find a place to try the cookie. They have a seating area at the side. I'll sneak a table from somebody that's already sitting down. Hi, miss, you don't mind if I join you, right? Thank you. Oh. And I'll try some of the brie and camembert. So I'm going to try the almond cookies. Mm. I like this one. You know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of um, not in Katu Cake, yeah, in Katu Cake. That's what it reminds me of. It's nice. Ubi gooey and tangy. I like it. I like to make the almond actually. Like almond chocolate covered almonds. I tried opening up the, the brie, but uh, it's not cut up already. It's not like individually cut up and packaged and put it in the round thing. You have to go and cut it yourself. If they could do something like that, I guess it would be good so that you can have individualized tasting of it. That, I think it's the same for the camembert too. Okay. Thank you guys for visiting St. Lawrence Market with me. Thank you, lady, for making me sit. <laughs> okay, bye. Have a blessed day, everyone. I have another bite of the biscuit, the almond cookie. It was really good. I love it. Okay, I'm on my way home now. <laughs> so it is. Hi guys, I got home and I tried the camembert first. It's not my cup of tea. I don't like camembert. But the brie is really nice. It's creamy and nice. And the wine that I bought, when I tried it, this is it. It's a Sauvignon Blanc. I tried it. It wasn't sweet at all. It was like really, really not sweet. So what I did was I added sweet and low three packets into the bottle. 
and now it tastes sweet and you still get the buzz from the alcohol and I can enjoy drinking it it tastes really 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 good so try it if you if you find your alcohol not too sweet just try some sweet and low to it and it'll give you a nice taste and flavor okay thank you for joining me today bye and have a blessed day